Hey kids, this is Clear. Let's play some more Hyper Princess Pitch. Now you recall last time, we unlocked the secret level. Also, you'll excuse me if there's a little bit of audio lag. The video kind of screwed up, because this game is a little hard on my computer. Anyway, the secret level is notable for two reasons. One is the enemy selection we'll be showing in a bit. And two, because clearing the secret level let you unlock the secret ending of the game. There is a secret ending. Oh no, space nerds! Yeah, this is a this is a reference to some other game Daniel Remar made. I don't know. I've never played it because it's a scrap pack game. But yeah, they're basically the same as elves except they look weird. I guess. Anyway, yeah. The, Enemies here are pretty tough, so I don't usually go for the secret ending on really hard difficulties. I think since I'm on, uh, what is it, Battle Princess, then I'll be okay. I can't do it on War Queen, though. I almost can do it, but almost isn't good enough. And my dog wants me to open the door for him. He doesn't actually come in, though, because when I open the door, it frightens him. Come on. Good boy. He's a good boy. I want you all to know this, people on the internet. My dog is a good boy. Alright, that's that room from here. What's over here? Presents. Destroy them. Yeah, this room is not very hard at all. I mean, the first wave can be taken out really easy, and then the second wave is just a bunch of space nerds. Or maybe they're called something different aside from space nerds, I don't know. They explode real good, though. Gathered up power-ups while cats circle me. What's over here? Oh no, three of these things. But oh wait, I have the hyper power up, so I don't care. You are all toast. My gold bricks that destroy everything. Yeah, the final room in the secret stage before the boss always has four X's on the ground. You can a pile driver on if you don't screw it up three times in a row like I did. But they only drop strawberries there, so only do it if you really want the extra points. Oh, I lost a life. Dang it. And we've made it. To the boss! say more there, but uh, you do not interrupt the goddess of explosions. You just don't. Anyway, now we know the galactic princess buster. Come on. We can only use it in stage four, though, so we're gonna Rainbow. make it count. Rainbow. Rainbow. Anyway, like I said, there's a mini boss here I want to show off that I didn't get to show off last run, so we're gonna be going... I'll still try to take as much of a new route as I can compared to the last time, though. We're going left instead of right from the start, so I'm already in good shape for that. Yeah, I hear you. I don't know what you're supposed to be. Maybe you're Christmas tree ornaments. You are dead tree ornaments. Smite you with the bow ball of justice. If you go left instead of down there, you have a chance of fighting a robo clone of Princess Pitch. It shoots things everywhere and says it lines in a robotic voice, and it's really cool, and you should see it if you play the game. But we're going this way instead. This is the way to a boss of some kind. Yeah, just in here. This room with all the free power ups to start with, and a ton of enemies that swarm you as soon as you get in. Fortunately, a power fueled ice cannon takes them out easy. Let's go through that door down there with our catalyte. Oh no, it's Mrs. Claus! By Mrs. Claus, I mean 
When did we suddenly go into this game? Man, I'm glad I have a health bar here. Oh well, she's dead. We'll never see her again. Put your fat things down. So yeah, that was the boss I wanted to show off. If you know what I'm talking about, you probably know why. And even if you don't, then, I don't know, it's a boss of some kind. It look cool, right? Get out of here. What's over here? I don't know. Ooh, there's this thing. Man, those scythes with the Santa hats on, those are mean. Because they have a ton of health. Do a ton of damage if they run into you, and they, uh, they're just persistent. That's a really good cool thing. All right, I'm not gonna do the Goddess Buster in this room. I'm gonna just take it on honestly with my triple ice cannon and my triple rainbow lasers that basically just make the entire area unfit for human life or elven life or robot life because these are elven robots. You know that, right? The good Mecha Santa and his robot elves that I just pile drives. Alright. Let's take on Mecha Santa. Now with more lag. I really wish my computer wouldn't do this. And laughter and But oh well. I envision a world of joy and laughter and awesome voices. I got a present for you, alright. Alright, so because this is on a lower difficulty, or actually my friend found out, because your score is lower, because it's a lower difficulty, Mecha Santa will only use some of the moves that you saw in the previous match. I think I'll be able to showcase most of them here. Like, you'll notice he won't actually use the Death Poke Storm or Death Metal Disaster Zone. Everything else, though, is fair game. Double dark blaster. Gigabomb breaker. Yeah, see, there's the gigabomb breaker. Oh man, that's not too scary. Legendary charge, which works the same as it always does. Uh, I love how there's the elves down there. They're just cheering Mecha Santa on. And they'll react differently to each of his attacks, too. Oh, this attack? No. No, I say! <laughs> and that's that. So, now we're gonna show off the secret ending. You can guess how it's different, you've been paying attention. And yeah, it's still a bit laggy. Sorry about that. As you can see, we now have a crown instead of our headband. He's still giving us a present, we're still very moved by this. Maybe this time the present will not be an explosion. The present is always an explosion. This time, buddy. Now you're done. Ooh. Oh. Look at all those elves. Just get blasted straight through the roof of Santa's fort. And we sent the world flying into the sun. Explosion blows a hole in the galaxy. And then the galaxy explodes for no reason. Oh man. And then after all that is said and done. A high five. Awesome. Yeah, this is <laughs> I love this game. More secrets. Do not read them. Awesome. Although I've already shown off most of them now, I think, on it. I didn't show off the cheat code, so. And yeah, that other one was the test run when I tried doing the all-in-one run. 
when I ran into that one mini boss, it kind of made sounds stop ha happening. But anyway, let's play the secret difficulty level. You guys ready for the difficulty level of, uh, where is it? Get over here, difficulty level. There we go. Really, Joel's mom. You guys like in jokes, right? Let's do this. I'm pumped. You're going to take on Really Joel's mom difficulty, intended for Really Joel's mom. All right, come here, you guys. Oh no! Whoa! They shoot, and there's so many of them. Suplex and pile drive for your life, bitch. No! What is happening? And they don't even have a hyper power up, and none of them dropped anything. It never ends. Oh, that is not a difficulty anyone can beat, except for really Joel's mom. I'm clear. This has been Let's Play Hyper Princess Pitch. Are you really Joel's mom? No.